guys. Today we're making beef stew. We're going to uh, use all these ingredients that's right in front of me. Look at this. We're gonna, we're gonna use wine. We're gonna use balsamic vinegar, red potatoes, beef, carrots, celery, onions, beef broth, salt, olive oil, you name it, we're gonna be using none of this here, so. So we're going to start, we're going to put salt on the beef, put it in the frying pan, we're going to brown it and saute it. And then we're going, as that's, that's, that's being done, we're going, to, we're going to cut the carrots, potatoes, celery, we'll put it all together and we're going to make a nice, beautiful beef stew. Okay, we have everything prepared, we have the onions all cut up, the garlic, potatoes, everything is, is all cut up. Now we're going to, we're going to go right in, on, into the stove and we're going to start searing, browning, and we're going to also put salt on the meat. We're going to put this at high heat. We're going to throw some olive oil in there. We're going to take two pounds, two to three pounds of, of beef. We're going to two to three pounds of beef. Open, put it all around. Now we're going, you can do this ahead of time, put the salt ahead of time and let it marinate. But I'm just going to do it just like this myself. I'm not telling you to do it the way I'm doing it when it comes to, to marinating the, the meat. So, I'm gonna take, I'm gonna take some coarse salt. I'm gonna put it on, give it some flavor. It's on high heat. We're going to uh, we're going to sear it, brown it, and then we're going to put it in the pot. Okay. Okay, we're adding the meat into the pot. We're gonna put a little water in, in the pan. We're gonna scrape all this off. We're gonna throw it in here. And we're, we're gonna start putting uh, salt, pepper, and all the vegetables that we need to do. All right, put a cup of water in, in the pan. We're gonna scrape all the juices. We're gonna create juice, actually. From what uh, we left. Okay, we're gonna put the juice in here. We're putting this at medium high. We're going to start throwing all, all of our vegetables. Carrots, putting in onions and garlic. Celery. Now we have this in here. Okay. I'm going to add some salt, some pepper. We're going to do a uh, half a teaspoon of pepper. You're going to do one spoon of salt. You're going to put a cup of wine. I'm adding a cup of wine. This will give it some flavor. We 
we're going to throw the we're going to uh, three cups of uh, broth. We're going to put three cups of broth and and one tablespoon of balsamic vinegar. Add four cups of broth. And we're going to put the balsamic vinegar. Spoon of balsamic vinegar and a tablespoon of flour. All right, we're going to mix it around. We're going to put the top on and we're going to let it cook. We'll be back. All right, now you're going to uh, stir this every 20 minutes, okay? Now you're going to keep stirring it until it thickens. Once it thickens, then, then we're going to throw in the potatoes, the last, the last ingredient of the of the uh, beef stew. All right, so every 20 minutes, you start, just like this. All right, then you close it up, put the top on, and come back later. 20 minutes have gone by, now we're gonna take off the top, look at that. And we're gonna stir. And now we're gonna leave it alone for another 20 minutes. 20 minutes have passed by. Starting to get there. We'll be back in another 20. Okay. Now that it's getting thick, we're going to add the potatoes. And we're going to continue cooking this until for about it's actually until it gets all nice and soft. We're just about done. We just gotta let the potatoes soften up. And uh and that's it actually guys. So let's wait for that. And then we'll put some in the bowl so you can see how it looks. Here we go guys, look at this, how beautiful this is. Wow, oh boy, put some on the, put some on the bowl here, so you guys can see it, look at that, wow, yeah, here you go on the bowl, look at that beautiful this is, wow, beautiful, thick gravy, Meat's nice and soft, the potatoes, it's just perfect. It takes, it, it took like two and a half hours to make this. But it's good, it's delicious, you're gonna love it. Uh, the recipe will be on, on the page, so uh, you guys can uh, follow that. Uh, just in case the, the gravy starts going down, it's this in, before you put the potatoes in, add some water and a little bit of, of uh, flour and stir it up and let it cook some longer, it'll get thick again and it'll give you enough time to cook the potatoes. So, but you have to put it, you have to cook it on low after that, once you put the potatoes in, because you want the potatoes to get nice and soft. All right, so uh, hope you enjoyed it and uh, talk to you soon. Bye.